guess running on my own is something that I do quite a lot and, and I love the sense of freedom and the sense of switching off from the world. I got into it much later thinking that it was a way of getting fitter for my football. It didn't work. I was never any better at football, but I started to enjoy the running. I have you know, a very competitive side to me. That is through my work and life, but actually running has never been competitive for me. It's more, I'm just happy to get into a, a zone for myself. I don't do anything before I run. I'm normally getting up early in the morning. I'm, I'm half asleep. I almost want to stay half asleep so I can just go out and do the run. From a post-run point of view, I always want to go and grab a great coffee. What I'm wearing is also important to me. I want to be in something that I feel comfortable in and I think I look cool in. I've always had a lot of personal history with, uh, with Adidas. I guess I've been wearing it all of my life. For the running performance team to work with us, that was really exciting because we're genuinely runners and we want great kit. Certainly we focused on you trying to get wool content. That was something that the team were really happy to work with us on. But also it's about trying to make the products very universal works in its shape and feel and colour. I've always run in a, in a cap, um, partly because I'm, I wear a cap. It's a performance piece, it's got air coming out the back of it, it works, it, it's a great piece. And it's very me. The opportunity to do it with Adidas was a, an honour and a, actually to put three stripes in our own kit was something that I've always wanted to do, so it was great for me on a personal level.